Hey man, I just want everybody to be safe out there. All my brothers out there and say, you know, you hear me? Y'all get into a jam with the police. I hope y'all make it out. You feel me? That's all I really got to say. And it's free, free a lot of people because it's a lot of stuff going on behind jail that a lot of people don't know on the streets. Toil, they be in, they dance at jail doing people wrong too. It ain't just really out here. They that. really get away with it enough. Flying a UDID 808. There's no other feeling than just flying these things. And then I wanted to do more and more ever since, such as FPV. I wanted to see what I was flying. Trouble? I would say kind of. I accidentally, this is, this is bad, I uh, was flying back, I lost sight of my, my uh, thing and it landed on a balcony. I'm an engineer by trade. This is a craft, something that I like to crash and rebuild and build better, get ideas from meetups like today. You're going to crash, it's, it's, a part of, it's, it's, a, it's a part of the hobby, um, you know. It's just something you got to be ready for, and uh, you know, get back, get back on your feet again, and uh, you know, keep flying. The saying goes, "If you're not crashing, you're not flying enough." Pizza nine to five. I'd rather be flying, uh, flying robots than uh, you know, pushing paper all day. So yeah. Her lease is up in her apartment in Chicago uh, at the end of May. <laughs> she can always come back in the basement. She, she, you know, if she wants to just um, park herself there for a while and, until she regroups. Well, I have a great studio set up down there. There's a water softener that occasionally goes on every 20 minutes, so that keeps me on my toes. Um, the only piece I sold was actually presented in my basement. My plumber bought it. Um, he actually titled the piece, too, when he yelled up to my mom. Hey Stace, how much for the dog with tits? It was a picture of a dog on a woman's body. So um, the basement has been, has been pretty good for me.